y'all. I ain't never talked this much in my life. Why am I lying? Hey, Luz. It's my Mai. And welcome back to my channel. If you subscribe, thanks so much. And if you haven't done so already, what are you waiting for? Oh, yeah. And also turn your post notifications so you can get notified every time I post a new video. And give this video a thumbs up. And also comment down below to let me know what your favorite boot is and what you would pair it with and all that good stuff. And everything will be linked below. Some boots are already linked in my previous videos. So this is basically like a review on each boot that I have. Some of them you probably haven't seen before. So it's going to be long boots, boots with heels, boots with no heels. So I'm basically just going to go over basically three questions. So, where did I get the boot from? What would I pair the boot with? And how well does the boot fit? Like, what's going on with it? Is it tight? Do you need to go up a size? Is it a little too snug? If it's a heel, does it hurt? How long can you wear it for? All that good stuff. So, stay tuned. And we're going to get right into the video. So the first boot, I'm just going to go ahead and jump right on into it. It's the boot from my previous haul, from my previous little thing haul. And it's my favorite, one of my favorites. It's the fold over boot. With the heel. So, oh, like I just said, it came from pretty cool thing. And I basically will pair this with, like, my ideal outfit will be a mini skirt talking a mini and then or like a mini skirt or something chunky and oversized over the mini skirt or either like a graphic tee with the micro mini skirt and a leather jacket and this is like the nighttime like you do all black fit with it or um I'll put an example right here of how I or recently styled it I have two different outfits where it was like kind of like kind of dressed up kind of basically casual and it's a two-piece set it's like a short skirt it's tweed material and I also have it with my cargo pants even though you can't really see the full detail of the boot you can see like the bottom part of it as you can tell in the video but I think it really still came out cute because that's like more of a casual fit I'll wear with it even though I can still put together casual fit with a micro mini skirt because I feel like the tweed outfit is like casual if I want it it doesn't really look too dressy especially with the crop how I crop that shirt if I wanted to like make it extra casual maybe a shirt wouldn't be as cropped and more conservative you know but for the most part that's like my ideal ideal outfit Marco mini skirt, like an olive, um, deep olive tone mini skirt with this and like a beige oversized chunky hoodie or, um, even olive. I'm just picturing it in my head because I like a cozy, cute outfit. I'm not really that dressy. I can dress when it's time to dress, but I really like a real casual fit if you know what i mean oh and with the suede fold over boot with the heel from pretty little thing so it's very comfortable when you put your foot inside of it but wearing it for long periods of time like standing of course and walking i wouldn't recommend it's your foot's going to be on fire because i had it on in my video when i was trying on clothes so i was standing in it for like couple hours maybe two hours and it was killing me so yeah there's that but overall the fit is perfect if you have white calves you can get your regular size it's white calf friendly and it has a zipper on the side so if you get anything you think your foot can't fit it can <laughs> don't think otherwise and yeah, that's basically it for that boot. So I'm gonna keep it moving. And the next boot is gonna be another pretty little thing boot. And it's the black matte Chelsea boot that was also in my previous video. Um, my pretty little thing haul. 
this bad boy right here. And when I look at this boot, I just picture like an all black fit. But I also love my neutrals. So I'm giving, it's giving like an all white jumpsuit or a nude jumpsuit. It's giving very casual. This boot also look cute like a short skirt. In this video, you can see me wearing it with an all black bodysuit. And um, this Kelly green jacket looks really cute. It's for like, it's giving like rain weather. Like if it was raining, that's the outfit I'll wear when it's raining, even though I don't like to wear cute stuff when it rains. Like I'm gonna wear a good boot when it rains. But like my outfit, it's gonna be real casual. But that's the fit I put together for this boot. This boot really just goes with anything. The only bad thing about this boot is the fit of it. So if you have really wide calves, size up. If you don't, you can get your regular size. Um, but you wouldn't, it just depends on your calf. If your calf is really, really big, you have to size up one size. See, my calf isn't really that big, but it's still kind of thick. So if it didn't have the stretch, stretch material right here on the side, I would not be able to wear the boot. So that's the main thing that I love about this boot, that it has this right here. So it's basically wide cap friendly, but kind of not because it's kind of stiff. It's not that stretchy. Well, I guess it is stretchy, but once you put it on, you'll see what I mean. But I feel like once you keep wearing it a lot, it'll be much easier to put on and off. If you get what I mean. And then this boot is comfortable to wear all day long. Um, it's not going to hurt your foot. Um, it's also very wide foot friendly if you have a wide foot. Because um, some people have like narrow feet so they can wear like very like pointed shoes. But this one's like wide foot friendly. So go ahead and cop this boot. It's very comfortable. Only thing is if your calves is really thick, size up. Or just be very mindful that it possibly will be really tight until you keep wearing it much longer so it can like stretch out a little bit all right so that's it for pretty little thing boots so i have my next two boots are from fashion nova they're basically the same color this is one boot It's basically the same as that boot, but it's made differently. And then that one was a nude, and then I have this one in olive. Gorgeous. And I'll insert a clip of the boots and what they look like right here. And I'll show what I've worn with them as well. You can dress them up, dress them down. You can do as you please. Um, so I'm basically just gonna jump right into how does the boot fit. Those fit phenomenally. So you can get your exact size in those boots. You don't have to worry about it. I know they do not have a stretch band on it, but trust me, they are thick calf friendly. They are wide foot friendly. They will not hurt your feet if you have them on all day. Okay, so my toenails was long. <laughs> like my baby toenail was really long. And so I kept rubbing the side of the boot somehow because I had on like these really thick socks. So. Be mindful of how long your toenails are and what, how thick your socks are <laughs> when you wear these boots because that was the only issue I had when I wore these for a long period of time. And so that hurt a lot. But other than that, they fit really well. I have no complaints about these boots. They, they are a bit ass, like how they feel. They feel a little ashy, but... They remind me of like rain boots and it does have a zip on the side if I didn't say that already. But yeah, love those boots. Perfect. Clips of me wearing outfits with them. Y'all, I ain't never talked this much in my life. Why am I lying? I'm so thirsty. Last boot of today sorry they've been a little dusty I don't think I've wore these in a while okay 
these boots right here. Oh, why am I lying to y'all? These boots came from Pretty Little Thing as well. They're a white half friendly knee. Why am I lying? This is not a knee high boot. The boots I showed y'all were knee high, but these are a thigh high. So they come all the way past your knees. They're extremely long, as you can tell. They come with this little itty bitty heel. It's not your typical uh, stiletto heel for like your thigh high. So they're not, I'm gonna say, mm, kind of on the fence with those, with trying to tell y'all whether or not if they hurt your feet or not. Because they do and they don't. So let me put it this way. If you are walking in them for a long period of time, cool. You're moving, you're not standing in one spot, so no. They don't hurt your feet. If you're out, concert, standing, yes, they're gonna hurt your feet. You're standing in one spot. So those hurt shockingly when you're standing in just one spot. But overall they fit perfectly. You can get your regular size. I believe I got a size eight in these. Oh, no, this is a US five. So I got a size seven of these. So I went down a size in these boots. But if you have really thick calves, even though they are wide calf, thick thigh and wide calf friendly, um, you might need to size up. That's why I said, because I used to get a size seven from Pretty Little Thing, but some of their shoes weren't really um, big. Yes, yeah, so usually when it says like wide calf friendly, I usually go down a size. I don't think the fold over boots said wide calf. I'm gonna have to double check that. But it will basically be in the description if anything. But yeah, those boots go perfectly with anything. I worn them with the oversized crew neck before to dress it up. Um, I'll insert a picture of that. Um, I've worn these with, um, I think I wore these on Halloween with like just a bodysuit, just like some risque type of outfit um and some see-through tights um you can wear them over jeans they look bad with some jeans some medium wash jeans um you can do an all denim look with it um with the medium wash uh denim look it'd be fire if i put the outfit on i'll put it up here but those are like a few options to wear with those boots but yeah, also yeah, I already went over how the boot fit. So the foot fits, the foot fits. Girl, what are you talking about? Wow, was my hair sticking up like that this whole time? Wow. Maybe it wasn't. Maybe if you go. Okay. So yeah, went over how the boot fits. It fits phenomenal. I love that boot. I wear that boot to death. Like it fits so perfectly. But my favorite boot of all, y'all know, is the little fold over suede tan boot. <sighs> like, it's just like the perfect fit. Like, you have to purchase it and see what I mean. And when you slide your foot in it, it's like you found the glass slipper. <laughs> like, from the Cinderella story. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm like food deprived. I'm hungry. So yeah, I'm about to wrap up this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, so I obviously went over why I like the boot, how does the boot fit, and what I would wear with the boot. So please give this video a thumbs up. And comment down below um, and let me know how you um, felt about each boot. And turn on your post notifications so you can get notified every time I post a new video. <sighs> and if you haven't done so already, Go ahead and subscribe to Ma, and I'll be posting another video soon for you all. So stay tuned. Thank you so much um, for watching, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye, booze.